Hey YouTube, just want to do a quick app review on uh, an application called Remote X for the iPhone. It is a really actually cool uh, application that lets you control your PC from your iPhone. Um, we'll be doing this on my iPhone 3GS. Um, just go ahead and get started. Okay, let's scroll over to the app. There it is right there, Remote X. Now you will have to download some uh, software, um, and I'll have a link in the description on uh, where to go ahead and do that from. That way you download it to your PC, so your PC will recognize your phone. Okay, now as you can see right off the bat, you have a play, a pause button, and your skip forward, skip backwards, and your reverse and forward. You also have the volume down and up, full screen. Um, repeat, shuffle, run and quit, uh, your settings, and your media services. So real quick, um, just to let you know how this works, let's go down here. As you can see, there's a mouse button. Just click on the mouse button, and you have a virtual mouse. Okay, my mouse is over there. And here we go. I am now scrolling the mouse with the iPhone. Let's just uh, go to something real quick and uh, go ahead and double click on an application and it will go ahead and run the application. That is iReb. A uh, very, very helpful tool if uh, you're into jailbreaking, um, especially if you're testing or developing. Let's go ahead and uh, exit out of that. Alright, now I'll give you an idea of what else this controls. Let's go up to the top here. And uh, as soon as that focuses, there we go. There's a media button. You click that. Now here are the programs that it starts up, controls, um, as well as with the virtual mouse. Um, as you can see, you got Windows Media Center, iTunes, VLC, and so forth. Uh, this is a new laptop for me. I just got this, so I didn't install my VLC yet. But we'll go ahead and run iTunes. Okay. Now I've clicked on the iTunes button. We'll go ahead and click on the run button okay and iTunes should pop up on the PC here shortly give it a second it is iTunes um, give it a minute here and there it is you have iTunes up uh, let's say you want to hear a song. Once again, use your virtual mouse to scroll and uh, go ahead and select something. No, we do not want 911. Okay. It's the new iTunes that came out. Me personally, with um, my jailbreak and everything, I'm fine where I'm at. I don't need a new version of iTunes. It's up to you if you want to go ahead and do it, but me personally, I don't need to. So let's go down here, and let's say uh, you want this full screen. There should be a full screen, yeah. Right here is the full screen button. Let's go ahead and click that. And iTunes now is in full screen, and it is in cover flow mode. Okay, here's the cover flow button. Let's go ahead and click on that. It's already on cover flow, so I'm not sure that it'll do anything. Um, let's just exit out of the full screen mode. And there you have it. It's back to normal. Uh, another great thing, just besides, um, like I said, the fact that it controls all your ma major media programs. Uh, another cool thing, if you go up... There's a little settings wheel here. I'll go ahead and click on that. 
and you will see your computer right here. Go ahead and click on that. You have your PC under your name. You can actually reboot it, hibernate, close the program, turn it on, and turn it off. So let's go ahead and turn my PC off. Now we'll have to wait for iTunes to close. There it goes. And a pop up comes up saying the iPhone is disconnected and the computer is shutting down. Once again, guys, that's uh, Remote X. If you like this video, make sure uh, down here to click like. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. I appreciate the votes and every comment that comes through. All right, guys, until next time. Catch you later.